Matt Peters, First Peters, First Peters, chapter, chapter one, verse fourteen. As obedient children, not furnishing yourself according to the form of lust in your ignorance, but as which has called you is holy. So be ye holy in all manner of conversation. I like to give all prayers and honor the Lord Yahweh Shemel Shabbat Shem Rakhakurash. The water Yahweh Shemel Shabbat for giving us the apostles and the elders of great millstone who deserve double honors, rightfully so. Shalom to the Aki, I'm pushing the words of sincerity and truth for being faith based and being prepared for what is to come. And what is to come? Race for his family, concentration camps, the Alpha IT checkers, the Mark of the Beast, 200 million missiles in the soil of America. Simultaneously, the cherries of the Lord let the whole full life into the chambers. Simultaneously, the cherries of the Lord shooting ladies of being that they are ungodly and the heathens, rightfully so. Hey, I'll be right this out of all to the course of this video. Salakia is a, uh, um, for, um, for anything I ever done to any brother, you know, if I offend you, Salakia. Um, that's how you're supposed to, we're supposed to conduct ourselves with our brothers, you know. I know coming to this thing has been a little rough, a little rocky. For me it has, you know. I always want to make sure anybody's comfortable, you know, around me. Because, uh, hey, we come from all walks of life. We may not have been, you know, brought up the same. But the Lord has called us. And we now we know what we're looking forward to. We look, we know what we're looking forward to. We're looking forward to be chosen. And how we're going to do that? We gotta have brotherly love. We gotta, um, we gotta um, um, take care of one another. And our apostles taught us these things, which is which is wonderful. I'm so happy that what I have been taught. Time is 5:18 a.m. in the morning. Monday, November 15, the year of the hasting of the day of the Lord. And that's what we should be, we're supposed to be hasting, we're supposed to be um, wanting the Lord to come back soon, like ASAP, get all this, get this party started. Because it's, uh, it's hell on earth right now. <sighs> this hell is a bad condition. All right, we ain't talking about the grave. Everybody ain't dead, and we ain't dealing with, we ain't up with polyon somewhere with a, with a fork, with a pitchfork. You know? We are in the flesh, going through hell, and hell is a condition. It's like heaven is a, it's like heaven is a condition, hell is a condition. They always say the black man's, the black man's um, hell is the white man's heaven, something to the fact. Alright, so, um, we gotta learn to keep our house furnished, and um, and how you keep your house furnished with um righteousness, with a holy conversation. Not not without always, without always is, is jacking that jacked us up. All right, and that's true. All right, so I'm gonna try to make this quick. Um, get ready to go to the plantation. And um, and yeah, being tired of this place is nothing wrong. I'm hating this place. And we came out of this world, bro. And now we gotta keep, we gotta stay on the track of this new world to come, which is for few, not for many. Um, so like, hey, so like, yeah, I just wanted to get this verse. Um, it says, uh, kind of lost my thought. I was looking for the verse, but this world, yeah, this world is made for. For, for everyone, like right? the good and the bad, it dwells amongst here in in, in the mess. Okay, fuck. <laughs> Alright, this this is a mess. This earth is a mess right now. It's terrible. Okay, but the new world to come is gonna be perfect. It's gonna be ran perfectly. Alright, because it's gonna be perfect righteous men running the earth. Alright, Second Ezra chapter eight verse one. And he answered me and saying, The Most High has made this world for many, but the world to come for few. All right? And that few is going to be the elect. That's because going, they're going to go. Because anybody could be in America. In America, everybody could have their own fucking shit. You go down to China, they got Chinatown. They got the Italy town. They got all Italy. And they never, they're not in order. 
It's all out of order, man. There's a lot of shit going on in everywhere, man. This place is a mess, man. It's lucky. I kind of lost my thought. Turn of thought. I lost how the Lord bring it back. All right. That verse stuck out. All right. Because we've been a part of this world. All right. So, we learned how to conduct ourselves with holy conversation and to furnish our bodies with, with the truth of Yahweh Shem and it, and, it, and it has sustained us, bro. I, I truly believe I, in, in faithfulness. I don't do worldly stuff no more. I don't hardly, I don't hardly get to talk to anybody that I didn't know in the world. And if we do have a conversation, it, it, it may... You know, it may spark some from the old stuff. Like, oh, yeah, 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 ha, ha, he, he. But then we get back on course, man, because we, we, back to reality. All right? Back to reality. Reality is, look what's going on around you, man. They got the floor nightingale juice just popping up like popcorn, bro. This is, this is crazy, man. But it's spiritual, though. In the flesh, you're like, oh, man, you get all, because you got to go to work. You don't know what the next level is. You know, motherfuckers might say, hey, you ain't. You can't get in without the floor nightingale juice. People are pissed off, man. They hate Brandon. <laughs> oh man, yeah. And they hate the other lady, the lady that ran with that running with Brandon. She's crazy, man. Ephesians chapter two, verse two. We're in past time, ye walk according to the course of this world. And that's this world's for few. I mean this world this world right now is for many. The next world's for fruit a few according to the prince of the power of the air which is Satan the, the spirit that knoweth now walk walketh worketh in the children of disobedience and it does man this world is a very disobedient world man that's why this world is for many like the scripture said let's read it again real fast because um I was just thinking about this verse. Now I know where it's at. Because I was trying to remember where it was at. But I found it. And I, and I know the Lord wanted me to bring it out. All right. Second Ezra chapter 8 verse 1. And he answered me saying. The Most High has made this world for many. But the world to come for few. All right. That's, that's, that's dope. Because the few. The few, the meek, and the humble is going to run the next world. This world, what is it? How you say it? Uh, it's it's uh, like the, the army of marines or some shit. The few, the proud, the marines, some shit. They always proud. You can't be proud. You gotta be proud for it. You can't even go. You gotta wait. The military guys, they quitting because they don't want to take the floor nothing. They know it's like something going. Because they've been over there and, the, the, you know what? I ain't never, you know, I, it's drugs over here, right? Contact, I mean, you got whatever. But over there, they probably put all types of shit in their people, man. Those marine guys and the people that did them um, spies that go over there to other countries, they them did things to those other people. And now they scared. Now they said, my own government want to put stuff in me? Oh, I don't know. I sold what I did to RBBB. Shit, man. I'm telling you, man. They, that's why people are lying. You know? People that took it, look, the athletes are dropping dead. It's dropping, running up and down the court. Can't run like you ran before. You put that shit inside you, you can't fucking um, run. It's crazy, man. Alright. According to the prince of the power of the air, the spirit that now worketh in the children of disobedience. And that's the spirit of Satan. Satan is in his world, man. This is Satan's world. You know? So that was that is stuck out. And, and we have to have a holy conversation based upon what we have been taught. And we know our our apostles is taught as well, man. And we watching how our, our elders is um doing what they do and it's it's and it's, and it's accurate. You know? Ephesians chapter 5 verse 6 Let no man deceive you with vain words For because these things come to Cometh the wrath For these things 
for, for, for because of these things cometh the wrath of Yahweh upon the children of disobedience. And that's why I tell you, they, those, those people that's doing that, what they're doing, they're going to get paid. They're going to pay for it. And then what are you going to do? What are you going to do? You get caught up in this. You don't want to go back in this world. This place, the wrath of Yahweh is coming to the children of disobedience. You can't help them. You can't. Who's going to help you? You don't try to help them, and then the people behind you push your both of you guys in the damn ditch. That's why you gotta be mindful of um of these people around. You. That's why you gotta be you gotta always be somewhere else. Hey, I'm gonna say this. All right, you um um you stay on this course of righteousness, right? We we understand that. If we stay on this course of righteousness, that we're going to get salvation. I brought this out with those men and with those women, right? The, the men and the women and the children that we got. We the one third. Because we stand on the course. You know, you don't want, we're not doing this in vain work. We're not trying to, we're not, I know for me, I brought this out the same men that I'm coming up with. They're not doing this in vain work. You know, the Apostle the Hall just, Apostle Cabal just put up a video about spies. Infiltrators. I brought this out that, um, that the men I'm, I came up with, with that they, they, they the ones that stand stiffly for y'all watching y'all shy. They're not, they're not spying. They're not trying to get a filthy. They're not in the back of their mind. They're like, oh, fine, we got them. We got them. <laughs> hey. There is a lot of things going on in this world. And I don't know. I'm just going to stay in the course of righteousness. I'm about to say, I'm one of those men that, that stand stiff for y'all watching me on the Because the brothers, the brothers, I love the brothers, man. You know? I got a lot of brothers and sisters in the world. But coming back into this truth, this is the true brotherhood. You know? There's no way in hell that this is fake. You can't fake this. You can't fake righteousness. You know? It burns up inside you when you can't, when you gotta, you gotta confront your own thoughts, right? And the people that you see around you, man. It burns inside, man. It makes you angry. It's a lot of Mmm. I had, a, I had I, I actually I'm gonna tell you the truth. I'm gonna tell you um I tried to do the video like twice and I don't know I hit the wrong damn button. It, the last one I did was perfect. It was like bang, I was like, oh man, it was dope. And I hit the damn delete button by accident. It was so that was funny as hell. Alright, so lucky. <laughs> Alright, maybe it's because it's gonna be shorter. Let's see, let me see I gotta at least that verse I brought out. Pay that one out. Yeah, Titus chapter three verse three. For our, for we also, for we ourselves also were sometimes foolish, disobedient, deceived, serving diverse lusts and pleasure, living in malice and envy, hateful. And hating one another. We had that. We was the ones in this world, bro. You know? I always fought to have my own stuff. But, you know, you got people that... We've been around these people. We've been in the part of this world, man. Hateful, you know, having lust after shit. Malice. Alright. <clears throat> Alright. Doing wickedness. You know? Smoking cigarettes and weed and shit. <clears throat> We came out of that, man. That's mercy. This is mercy, bro. This is mercy. But after that, the kindness of the love of Yahweh, our Savior, towards men appeared. Not by work of righteousness, which we have done, but according to his mercy, he saved us. 
by washing by the washing sloppy. Come on. By the washing of the regeneration and renewing of the Holy Spirit. So we got clean, bro. Man, these words, these words is clean, cleaning us, man. So, hey, I didn't get that one. Maybe the Lord wanted that one to come out. Wow. Okay, maybe that's probably the reason why. All right, so we're going to end it with this one. All right, Acts chapter 17, verse 30. And in, and in the time of our ignorance, Yahweh winked at, for now come, commanding all men everywhere to repent. So they go to the point. Maybe the other video was kind of long, but this one, yeah, yeah, okay. I like to give all prayers and honor and glory to Yahweh Shemel Shah, by Shemel Kakudash. The water Yahweh Shemel Shah for giving us the apostles and the others a great millstone, deserve double honors, rightfully so. Shalom to the Akim. Wa Aba Abo Kum Yashah.